Right, so, part... Part four. Start of part four. four. Yep. Tenth hole, par five. Yep. Um, I didn't get a distance, but it's about 500-ish, I Mate, think. Mate, if you look up there, the crowd's come out. One, two kangaroos. They love him. They love you. I have never seen... The king of Caloundra, Richardson. Hey. Eh? So you've got bunkers out there off the back pegs to cover. Yep. Um, and then, uh, yeah, that, that's basically it off the tee. Because yeah, that little, second one's a fair way down, the one yeah, on the right, isn't it? Yeah, like that's uh, probably 20, 30 minutes short of greenside. Yep. Um, and then you've got greenside bunkers to deal with. And an, another reasonably narrow green. All right, yeah. Like there's a drop-off on the right-hand side, um, but overall it's pretty narrow. I've noticed with a lot of these greens, uh, what you think, you are probably nearly better to be short. Yes, so it's better to be short in and front then, because and you you'll get the punch chips. it. You, you'll be chipping up the long way of the green. Correct. Yeah, you, you literally go straight up the green. Yeah, rather than being to the sides of them. Exactly, mate. Exactly. Exactly right. Well said, Richo, because that's exactly the case. I think. Mm. That's a draw. Zero spin. Up. Straight down the middle. Yep. Good shot. Thanks, mate. Keep it away from the bunkers because Keep I don't away. think that one would have covered it. It's a bit yep. high, Tully, but it's good. Shot. That's good. This is Australia. Australia. You reckon that one must have got to have a joey in it, doesn't it? It, it looks like it. Hey? Potentially that's the joey, you reckon? I don't know. There's it's a big, big old joey, unless there is a joey in there. There's big bulbs going on there. There could be feet there, maybe. Yep, maybe. Rich, come on, mate. You were chasing them all around bloody Perigian, weren't you? Oh, hip switch. Right, yeah. <laughs> You're all hip yeah. switch. Keep an eye on this one, Skip. <laughs> mate, I reckon he's way out of your range, because there's me there. He's way out of your range, mate. Yep. Straight at him. Oh my god, Richo. Mate, can you hit it any straighter than that? No. Okay. Is that the Iraqi speed dog? What's that? <laughs> the kangaroo. There's a picture of a dog getting ready to pounce that looks like a kangaroo. Oh, mate. All right, almost still going. Um, 2.27, we'll be right back. Yep. 2.27 for the Richo relaxed one. Yep. Now, right beside your scone, a couple of nice houses again. There's a flag. 2.27 there, drop off to the right over there. A little bit of a layout. Yeah, No, there's a bit of room out there left, mate. Yeah, watch ahead. Yeah, no, no, you'll you'll be near the path. It's fine, it's but you but you got to you got to hit it over the bunkers. All right, so what do you got, mate? Shot, uh, just a tad less than you. Yep. Down breeze, I think, like two two twenty four. Um, wind helping a little bit. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit behind. A bit of a drop off to the right. Boys are loving it. Someone's had a hole in one. Oh. Hopefully you can just kind of feed it up over the hill a little bit. Yep. Um, yeah, just kind of thread, thread the gap. Oh, go in the hole, please. Oh, Richo. Is that long or is that, what's that doing? Oh, it's all glary off the screen from behind us, You're mate. You're joking me, mate. You no, better was, have got that. I got it. I is was... that on the back edge? Give me a look. Is it there? There it is. Look at it. Yeah. Move it just this way a little bit. There oh, that's a great shot. Yeah, shot. <laughs> hey! Okay, so I'm up near the green. I've hit a goodie, but again, if you hit it just a tad right, it's a big drop-off down there. Um, Rich has got, I don't know, 40 metres, 30 metres tough shot he's probably going to end up either short in the bunker 
or over. Oh my God, that's so good. Oh my God, Richo. It's the best shot you've ever hit. Rightio, mate. Great shot in. You got this for Eagle. Eagle. Don't know which way it's breaking. Um, but you see over here, like I, you probably can't see on the camera how steep it is. Yeah, it does uh, run That's very. Eight, ten foot below, something like that. It's a, it's a long way down there. Ah, uh, it certainly is. Um, I think this is going right to left. Yep. Right to left, maybe a cup and a half, two, maybe a cup, something like that. Go. Mate, it was in all the way. Well, they say don't leave an eagle putt short. Anyway, mate, that is potentially the best shot you've ever hit. Like I was saying, that only had to cover the bunker by the tiniest yeah, amount. Yeah, it didn't give you much play with, does it? And it spun and it done everything that it was meant to do. But like I said, down there, that's 10 foot plus down where that drain is. It's not great. So this is for Birdie Richo. Yep. This better not be, you better not hold this. Oh. Thank God. Oh. Oh. Mate, I was like, I've hit perfect drive, perfect second shot, left it short, made a birdie. Mate, I had a perfect tee shot, perfect layup. Great, yeah, perfect layup to that perfect distance and a perfect par. That's where we've come back from. Very, very pretty. Yes. So, the 11th, par 3. How far, mate? 170. 180 metres to the middle. Yep. Um, pins up the front. Yep. And I think there's a false front. So a couple of metres on, if it kind of lands in there it or, or stops there, it's going to probably come back yep. way down. I've got a six iron. It's, you know, it's the, if the wind blows hard, it's probably not getting there. But it should be good for perfect for the middle of the green, hopefully. Just got to hit a good one, hey? Yep. But there's that little bit of gust like that, which might just stop it. Might just stop it. Oh, that's so poor. In that bunker. Yeah. Yep. That was a really bad swing. Oh well. So that was a poor shot, mate, for me. It's like, so it's falling off the tee and instead of, uh, you know, taking my time, you go and you hit it and you hit a bad one. So, I'm in the right hand bunker there. Deep, deep bunkers. Norman, Greg Norman design. Loves deep bunkers. Six on? Yep. 150 metres. Bit miss here, that's going to be short, but how short? Just down the swale at the front there, mate. Yeah, it just hey. hit high on the face, wasn't it? Yep. Right here. So I'm down that swale. Um, this is quite elevated, this one, isn't it? Uh, it's, I'm six foot and yep. it's seven foot above. It said seven foot. Yep. About there. Maybe more. Yep. Very deep bunkering. Good effort. Is that spin? Yep. What's that, 10 foot maybe? Yep. Good maybe. shot. I'll take it. Ah, good shot from out of there, mate. Tough shot down, down there. But if you're going to miss it, it's probably not a bad spot. Oh. Oh my God. I mean, you're left with about the same as me, but mate, that nearly jarred. It was nearly in the hole. That's all right. 
I just want to make sure I've got it up over the hill. And that's the thing. So, so walk. Yep. Come and come towards me, the camera. Yep. Uh, and then keep going a little bit higher. So that's where the false front is. Yep. So everything to the camera's right, your left, yep. is so a slope. I, I knew I had to get at least. Yep. Up to here, because anywhere here. Back at your feet. Back at my feet. Right, good shot out of the bunker there, mate. Cheers. Um, uh, moving that way. Whatever that is. Yeah. Camera's left. Probably, maybe a cup, maybe. Yep. Yep. Good part. Thanks, mate. Did that start? Is that where mine landed? No, I think it was a bit further over. Right, it was just a pitch mark there. Yeah, yep. right. And Richo's living the dream for par down the hill, mate. A little bit right to left. Kangaroos, look at that. King of the Kangas, Richo. Snap. Uh -oh. oh, I just didn't want to move much. I thought they might have just moved a little bit more. Yeah, I'd... it's downhill, but mate, that's good. That's, yep. that, that was given anyway. Um, what was that? Bogey. Bogey. And a par. And a par. Well, mate. I, I don't even remember what scores we are, but you'll see it pop up. Oh, I, I, I could be easily 10 under. <laughs> right, so. 12th hole. 12th hole, par 4. 300 metres. 300 metres straight down there, you can, you can see. Yeah, you can see the flag down there? Yep. Now, bunkers left, bunker a couple of metres short of the green, 20 metres short of the green or so. Yep. Um, it's not really a driver hole. I mean, we're back in the wind, so I can't get there. So really, it's like three wood or something laid up there, but you know, I'll hit driver. Um, but it's just, yeah, dead straight down there. Yeah. You just don't want to hit too bad of a tee shot and just kind of keep it in play. Yep. And um, then you got a short shot in for your second. Is that going to go in the pot? Just short of the pot? Just short. Yeah, well that was good. I hit that really toey, so I just kind of dove it out did. of the sky. I could see it diving straight out of there. But, but again, it's, it's safe. It's uh, it's a funny one because back in the wind, I would never hit driver because you can't get there. No wind to, no wind, even slightly downwind. There's a little, where that uh, bunker is, just to the right of it, there's a hill there, which can kick it forward and kick it slightly right. Well, that's beautiful. Imagine a world with no lollies, he says. Yep. Yep. No lollies and no chocolate. You hate chocolate, mate. I like chocolate. Do you? Oh, yeah. yeah. What's your favourite cash comment, Richardson? Oh, I don't mind the uh, the hazelnut one. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty cool. We may have just become best friends. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I reckon they're up. Oh, no. We better not become best friends because you would eat all my chocolate. I would too. Yeah. Oh, look, Russ and Dad. Don't eat it. <laughs> Uh, mate, oh, it's open where you're hitting that. Oop. It's left, it'll be in the trees. There's more of an opening there than there is further down, put it that way. Yeah, just overcooked it. You could be <laughs> you're thinking about chocolate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chocolate. Don't you hate that when you're oh, taste it. Yeah. Like I said, Rich, it opens up here, so you've kicked through the trees. Bonk. There, I'm on the other side, you know, a bunker. Yep. Uh, this I is can see the bunker. That bunker was to the right of the green, wasn't it? Uh, no, it's in front. In front. It's in front to the right. In front to the right, so... So you're 54. That's where it is there, I'm thinking... Going if you go straight, straight over where your head is, yeah, that's about right. Yep. Um, 54, mate, it's, it's a hit and hope, really, isn't it? Uh, yeah. <laughs> this is enthralling footage, you're not being able to see anything. Uh, it's just... Probably coming down around that gap there somewhere. Yeah, I didn't see it bounce before the bunker, so but it was heading towards that way. All right, so near the bunker. Somewhere there. Yep. So just left of that bunker there was where my ball went, but I'm not sure exactly where. Right. I'm just going to stand over here, mate, because I can't see the hole from behind you. No, because there's a hill there. I've got, yep. I've got 87 meters back in the wind. Yep. I'm going to say it's playing mid 90s. So I got a 54. Yep. Like a three quarter 54 or something along those lines. Yep. Just a solid one. That's 
right of it. Don't leak right. Yep. Yeah, you can, can you see it from there? Yeah. Yep, just right edge of the green. Yeah, it's right edge of the green. Bit hard to see from here, but yep, I saw it land and bounce. That wind must good be pushing shot. a little bit into and pushing a tad right. Yep, good shot. It's fine, it's fine. Right. What do you got? Nothing. Good. No, um, no, that's... Come straight over the corner of the bunker. I need to actually That's where we've come from over there. Left. He's talking still. I'm gonna hit, there's me short actually, but that's where we gotta go. Probably gotta throw it just in the middle of the hill. Probably only 10 metres at the most. As long as it doesn't check up. Um, it's not bad. You kind of think because it's so far downhill, you need, yeah. It's a funny old one, that one. Yeah, Good. no, I didn't want to go nuts. Yeah. And fly it. But that's alright, what's that? Three. So yeah, puff and pa. Something like that? Yep. Right. Three clubs laying in a row. Richo's club. Oh, I wasn't yeah. sure what we were going to take. <laughs> um, I don't know what this is doing because of the shadow, but... Wait a little bit left of the hole, mate. You reckon start left? That do you reckon? Yep. I, I actually do not know. Yeah, that, yep. was, that was terrible. Did you see it? it snagged up into that stuff? Yep. Uh, there you par, mate. Yeah. Yep. Kind of got lucky off the tee shot not to go in the pot or even snipe it left of where you did. And yep. You got to hit over a narrow part. Um, there's a couple of holes like that around here. It's great. No. Same sort of thing, Rich. Yeah, yeah. Just... Was that an easy bogan? Yeah, Bogan. Yeah. Easy Bogan. So it's 12th hole, Pelican Waters, bunker at the back there, lovely houses over here. Um, when the wind is not into, you can hit it in that scrub, that <coughs> bunker there, that's what that bunker's there for. Scrub over there, scrub back here. Mate, I thought the wind was going to kick up the salvo, and it, at the moment it's... It's been uh, pretty calm. Mate, it's been real good. Beautiful.